Hi guys, welcome back. Welcome, welcome. If you're new, welcome. You're always welcome here. How many times am I gonna say welcome? <laughs> Hi y'all. Anyway, I'm going to do a real chilly chill laid back unboxing of my Allure beauty box for the month of February. I always get confused because you know Allure box, they send a box whenever they want to and it's usually at the end of the month. So this is my February box and I'm going to go ahead and open that with you guys today. Now Allure Beauty Box, just in case you're not aware, it is a monthly makeup beauty subscription box that you can have delivered to your door. And I believe it's about $15 a month at this point. I'm currently on a special little deal of three months for $10, but we won't get into that. <laughs> So anyway, yes, it's about $15 a month for about five to six sample, sometimes premium sample size beauty products, makeup, skincare, stuff like that. So I really like Allure Box because they send some really nice brands and they also send some really good skincare. So that's what I like about Allure Box. Even though I do have a lot of little samples laying around to use, I like it because I get to try out so many brands that a lot of times I would not be spending my coin on, okay? So anyway, let's go ahead and jump right in. Now, they switched up their packaging a little bit. It used to be in a red box. Now it's in a white box. And they also give you one of these little clear plastic, well, this one's not clear, it's black. But they also give you like a little plastic baggy of goodies I still haven't figured out what I'm supposed to do with these but you know I guess it's creative so and you also get a little pamphlet every month that has all the product information as well as pricing in here so I'm gonna keep this handy while we jump right in okay so the first item I'm gonna pull out because it's pretty easy is a mask so it is this face mask here and it says Maman Flower Lab Essence Mask, and this is Rose. And I, me personally, I'm one of those people who actually likes the smell of rose. Some people don't like rose scented stuff, but I actually do. So this is nice to get, it's different. I don't know if I've ever had a rose scented sheet mask before, but let's go ahead and check out the specs on this. Oh, there's no information on this. Is this an extra? Oh, no, no, no. Here it is. Okay, got it. <laughs> you know, I guess it would help if I put my dang on glass. <laughs> glasses on. Y'all know I can't see shite without my glasses. Okay. So it says here, Maman Flower Lab Essence Mask. Retails for $7. Okay. Um... Using one of these K-Beauty sheet masks makes my skin feel like I've just poured an entire bottle of serum on my face. They're super hydrating. Maman's sheet masks come in seven varieties and you'll get one of those in your box. And each is infused with nourishing botanical extracts and moisturizing hyaluronic acid and glycerin which are essential now that temps are dropping fast. Okay, so, and how they do their information is usually somebody, it's kind of like a blurb that somebody wrote about the product. So that's why a lot of times I'll kind of try to feed through all the minutia to just give you like basic information on the product because they be writing a whole story about how this product changed their life and ain't nobody got time for that, okay? So anyway. That is the first item, a nice rose sheet mask. Okay, next I have here something from Model Co. Metallic Eyeshadow Trio. So this is what the little box looks like. So let's go ahead and take a look at this eyeshadow and see what is she popping. And on the back of the box, it looks like this is cruelty free. So that is cool as well. So, oh, this is pretty. Now, so this is what this looks like. These are the shades in here. Very, very pretty. I like them. That's nice. It's not my typical color scheme of eyeshadow that I would wear. It's not bright enough 
<laughs> but it would definitely make a nice beautiful just everyday type of shimmer look so that's pretty okay so let's see what it says about this and this is it just says metallic eyeshadow trio okay modello metallic eyeshadow trio in myconos okay so I guess that is the color, Myconos. Each of the powder eyeshadows in this trio, burgundy, pinky, champagne, and brown, creates a sheer wash of glittering color, which makes them perfect for everyday shimmers. Okay, and so this retails for $15. $15. <laughs> okay, so that is that. Next, I'm gonna pull this out since this is kind of right on top and easy. It is an eyeshadow brush. So this is what this brush looks like. It has a nice ridged handle as you can see. So what it says about this brush, it says Moda Metallics Triad Eye Brush. This soft precise shading brush is the holy grail of eyeshadow brushes. It does so many different things very well. It makes any shadow look its most vibrant. Use it to sweep brown shadow across your crease or over the outer third of your lid. Okay, and this retails for $4.99. So I guess this is supposed to work, you know, coincide with the eyeshadow. So I'm not mad at it. It's really, really pretty. And it's nice that they put complimentary products in there. Okay, next. Okay, this looks familiar to me. It's in the packaging that kind of makes you think it's like a lip gloss or a lipstick, but this is actually a mascara. So this is from Wander Beauty. It says Wander Beauty Mile High Club Mascara. Okay. I have a mascara in every purse. Multiple, I don't want to read all of that. Who cares? The brush is the perfect size to really get to the roots of your lashes and coat every hair. It comes in a squeezable tube so you can get every last bit of product out. Uh, it says just don't pinch the tube with the brush inside. Okay, nice little tip. This retails for 26 Zolas. Okay, so let me go ahead and let you see what that looks like up close. Okay, and so this is what it looks like up close. Mile High Club, it's just a really pretty gold tube of mascara. Very nice. I haven't even used my other Wander Beauty mascara that's in a burgundy tube. I think I have that in my travel kit, so hopefully it's not dried out already, but yeah, I'll be saving this. I don't wanna open it because, you know, I don't want it to dry out quickly. Okay, looks like I'm having a pretty good bag this month, you guys, or a pretty good box. Okay, so this is from The Brow Gal. And it's in a nice little sealed package. Let me just... So this, I'm pretty much assuming it's an eyebrow product, a gel product, which I really don't use. And it says Brown Hair 02. I don't use brow gels, so I don't know if I'm going to end up keeping this or throwing it in my giveaway box because I just don't use brow gels. Okay, for this, it says it retails for $22, so kind of pricey. The Brow Gal, the Instant Tinted Brow Gel. The formula's teeny microfibers are lightweight, so this doesn't have the crunch some other brow gels leave behind. It's perfect for minimalist makeup Yada, kit. yada, yada. Okay, so, yeah, I'm probably going to end up giving this away because I'm not going to use it. Okay. Ooh, I got two more things. Dang, this is a good bag. Okay. Okay, so this is from Laritzi Cosmetics, and this is a lip pencil. So it's in this cute little box. It says Laritzi Cosmetics. Let's see what it looks like. This is in the color Bear. <laughs> now, Bear has a lot of different definitions. Everybody's definition of Bear is not the same. So let's see what their definition of Bear is. All right. <laughs> So this is their definition of bear, a very, very light, like pink, pink, can't even talk, very, very light pink shade. So yeah, it's definitely not bear for me. Um, yeah. So let's see what it says here. Retails for $18. The formula isn't too waxy, so it becomes one with your lips instead of sitting on top of them. 
You can layer it under gloss for a shiny lip look that actually lasts. Okay, so although this really isn't a nude color pencil for me per se, if I did want to do like a really light pink on my lip, if I was going for a really light pastel look and I wanted a little really light pink look, I might just take it and actually use this all over my lip and put a really pretty gloss over it. And I think that might actually look nice. Okay, and lastly, I have one more item. And this is Mamond Petal Spa Oil to Foam Cleanser. Okay, so this is what that looks like. Just a really cute small bottle um, cleanser. And it looks like it's rose scented. So, <laughs> very cute little sample here. Let's see what it says. Mamond Petal Spa Oil to Foam Cleanser. Mamond's formula condenses the process into one step. Okay, so I guess um, they're talking about the K-Beauty technique of like washing your face multiple times. So it says that this condenses the process into one step. It starts as an oil and then with water it transforms into a foam. It dissolves foundation, mascara, and eyeliner quickly. Wow, that's pretty cool. And it retails for $21. Okay, so I'm very intrigued by that <laughs> because a lot of times, sometimes you'll have an oil, you know, makeup remover and you have to use soap to clean your face after you take your makeup off with that. But this is saying that it goes from an oil, from an oil to a foam. So it's like a two-in-one type situation. Cut out the middleman. I'm here for it. I'm here for it. <laughs> so, yeah, I can't wait to try this. I'm excited about this. So, let's just do a quick recap, you guys. Happy about this oil to foam cleanser. Lip liner, uh, I could have done without because, you know, I got melanin, so I don't need a baby pink lip liner. Um, mascara, I always love to get a new mascara because... Honestly, I really don't need to buy any because I'm constantly receiving mascaras. Bomb. This Brow Gal Brow Gel. I'm going to give it away. I'm not going to use it. This eyeshadow. Hmm. It's really pretty, but it's not really my thing. It's really not. I would much rather give this to someone who's actually going to use it. I'm more of a gigantic, humongous palette type person, so... I'm not going to use it. I'm going to throw it in my giveaway, but it is some really, really gorgeous colors. Very pretty. And eyeshadow brush. You can never have too many brushes, y'all. Y'all know that. And lastly, a rose face mask. I love any type of skincare face mask. I love the smell of roses. So this is right up my alley. I'm happy about it. Happy about it. So, so that's it, you guys. That is everything I got in my February Allure box. Thank you so much for stopping by to check out my video, and I will see you on the next one. Toodles!